Welcome to Wolf Spirit Productions. This is our very dirty truck that's about to get a truck wash at the TA in Oakley, Kansas. They have a blue beacon here. So they're going to wash our truck for us. We've been out west where it's snowing and they got the salt and all that gunk all over the roads. And when that gets on the truck, the truck doesn't look very clean and doesn't look pretty anymore. So we're going to get that taken care of today. Just the tractor. The trailer's going to be parked right here until we get back. Stay tuned and we'll see how this goes. Okay, so we're getting in line to get our truck washed. Looks like there is one truck waiting to get into the building. You can't see him from here. There he is. And they have the line separated from the rest of the parking lot. As busy as they have been in the past at least so this shouldn't take too long you probably can't hear it in the background but our dog Jester is whining back in the bunk I think he just wants attention wants out wants to run around It's about time for him to go for his midday walk anyway. We'll get that taken care of after Velvet gets her bath. And it looks like this truck in front of us is about to get in and get his bath. I've seen a lot of comments on Facebook of other drivers calling Blue Beacon the Streaking Beacon. Some locations are not as thorough, not as good at getting the truck washed very thoroughly. But we've been to this location, the TA Blue Beacon in Oakley, Kansas, a few times, and they're pretty good. Now, while we're waiting to get in, I'm going to pause the video and we'll be back in a few minutes. Okay, so it looks like it's our turn. The truck in front of us is pulling out. <clears throat> so right before it's our turn, somebody comes out and asks what we want done to the truck. And we basically got the whole nine yards. We asked for the rain -X, the undercarriage, the engine wash, and the brightener on the chrome. And that guy up there at the front is waving us up, going to tell us when to stop. Right there. Now for the fun part. They use high powered hoses to wash all the gunk off the truck, soap it up and everything. They gotta lift the hood up to wash the engine. has gone inside the office to pay for this. It's usually around 80 bucks, give or take. <clears throat> you 
can see the engine smoking there a little bit. We just drove for about two hours from Lyman, Colorado to Oakley, Kansas. The engine's a little bit warm. We're spraying all that water over it, making it smoke a little bit. Young lady over here. Mm -hmm. I think she's the uh, team lead. Well, that's cool. Mm -hmm. Most of the time, it's men that are working this job, but here lately, we've seen a lot more women in here in the various blue beacons we've stopped at. Yeah. Park right back here. <laughs> Engine's still smoking a little bit. That's what happens when you drive for a couple hours and then sprays water all over the engine. <laughs> So one of the people that's working here told me to cut off the video, so I guess we're not supposed to video while we're inside the building? I don't know. Never had that problem before, so. I'm going to pause the video here, and when we get back outside and hook back up to our trailer, I'll show you what the outcome is. Be back in a few. Okay, we're back, and we're exiting the Blue Beacon, heading back over to our trailer to hook back up and get back on the road. While Dee is hooking the trailer back up and raising landing gear and everything, I'll get out and look around the truck, see how it turned out. Look how much clearer the window is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the window is quite a bit cleaner now, after that. I don't know what their problem was with me doing a video in my truck. There's our trailer, still sitting there, right where we left her. Dirty as ever. <laughs> yeah, dirty trailer. We'll get her a wash later on. Maybe next month.
stay tuned and we'll be right back in just a minute. Well, she definitely looks better. Doesn't have all that salt and grime and stuff from the roads where they had snow and ice and all the last few days. And there's our mascot, Wolf Spirit. He's set up for spring right now, showing off the spring flowers. His eyes used to glow, but the battery box kind of got messed up with the salt getting all in that. wasn't watching anything that you're doing and there's our dirty trailer mud flaps are clean again purple for my husband's favorite color the truck is blue which is one of my favorite colors and then the purple mud flaps I say it passes. It's much cleaner than it was. Well, thank you for watching our video. And if you haven't yet, please subscribe. Hit the little bell for you getting notifications for next time I post another video, which is, should be soon. And if you like this video, please click the thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. Any suggestions for future videos. And we'll see you in the next one.